Hey everybody, Dom here. It's April right now, you know what that means. The folks at Moonlight MVM are once again hosting their annual April Fools themed Man vs Machine charity event. You should check it out. Being a charity event, it's possible to donate towards said event. Proceeds go towards the National Breast Cancer Foundation of Australia. Donating gets you in-game Team Forge 2 medals, specifically these medals. If you donate more than a certain amount, you can get all three. You can also earn a medal by playing Man vs Machine on their servers. You get this by beating 7 of 8 possible missions. This charity event ends on April 11, 2022, so if you have any interest in the event, like you want to donate or earn the medal, you should act before it's too late. The link to their site is in the video's description. It's pineapple.tf by the way. Pretty easy to remember. Now that the informational portion of this video is out of the way, let me show you some quick clips of the gameplay that occurs on these servers. I can go on and on all day, talking about just how freaking fun it is to play through this event, but why do that when I could show you? Yo, roll the footage! It appears as though the sniper's camper van is a flying tank. We should probably chase after it. Alright, this is a weird one. This boss soldier, represented by a troll icon on the HUD, has a rocket launcher that gives you three status effects. First it launches you into the air, like that. Then you get slow fall, and then you charge forward like a Devil Knight. Very strange, also very annoying, which is, you know, on brand for a troll soldier. And then there are falling tanks. This is it! The final wave! Uh, oh, okay, that, that's fair. I, I deserve that one. Sometimes on these missions, for balance or for a joke or whatever, loads of bots will join your team. Whoa, what? Huh. Words cannot describe what's happening here. Other than that car that's halfway through the ground is a Devil Knight, you can tell there's a shield on top, and it's killing that engineer. Rip that engineer! <laughs> Weird. Oh my god, this HUD. Ah, uh, note that I've not edited this at all. This is just how it is. My voice gives me super strength. 420 blaze it. It's weird that's the first thing that comes to mind. Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridge reference. I don't know why. It turns out there are cutscenes in this. Note that I did not edit any of this. The HUD on top and the bottom, it's just part of it. And, um, uh... I think that Bot Heavy was supposed to go to the Senator and punch him, but this cutscene's not playing out exactly how it's supposed to play. And instead, the Senator's staring at the Sentry. Alright, sure. <laughs> it's kind of more funny this way. This wave consists of many large pairs of pants. It's pretty self-explanatory. I mean, have you ever fought your pants before? I'm sure everyone can relate to fighting their pants one time or another in their life. And, um, uh, okay, there's actually nothing to talk about here. But, can we talk about the map used? They actually use MVM underscore example for this. And it works somehow. Before me is the largest pair of pants, and it shoots boots, homing boots, that explode upon impact, and it seems like it's dead. And there was a troll inside. Amazing. Here, keep the tree. Hey, check this out. I picked up a shotgun the bots dropped, and it shoots explosive ammunition. Wow. I wonder if it's upgradable. There's a heavy over there. He spins. I I ignore him. He he's just a heavy spinning. Hmm, uh, let's see. This weapon is not upgradable. Ah, oh, my disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. Uh, guys. Door's broken. <laughs> There's no doubt in my mind this is intentional and um, not a result of poor programming or anything like that. Right? Oh, that was weird, dematerializing, rematerializing. 
Like, honestly, didn't you learn about this in third grade? You're getting fucked. Uh, I don't know what earthquakes are. Uh, then you're gonna be no use against these earthquake robots. Go, 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 That's not a good sign. There's no HUD right now. And it wasn't a good sign. <laughs> Actually, fucking jump scared me. <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe I fell for that again. How did I fall for that again? I'm not gonna stand there anymore now. This friendly bot is named Get It Off. Ah, Get It Off. And this friendly bot is named The Voices Are Getting Louder. H. Hey, look here. But it appears to be a massive tank in the skybox. Well, there's no way I could deal damage to it because it's in the skybox. So this is probably a massive troll. Oh yeah, we're about to lose. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I believe that. I do not believe that. Pretend there is a really big and cool explosion happening right now. On to the next round. These Easter Island heads remind me of that one Mario game on the Game Boy. Um, Super Mario Land. It had enemies that didn't appear in any other Mario game, and the story was unique, and it had shoot 'em up sections. They should do another game like that. Whoa. A Pokemon. Alright, whatever. This guy has the same Pokemon on his conscientious objector. What's the chance of that? What's the likelihood this random human goes to the server and, and it just lines up like that? This thing is cursed. And now it's gone. Thank God. We're all laughing at the scout. TF2 moment! <laughs> we can kill these bots at any time. But they all started dancing, so... We're all dancing with them. Yet another TF2 moment. Oh, 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 no, oh, oh. Oh no, 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 oh no, oh no, oh, oh no, oh no, this is, looks bad. Oh no. Oh no, oh, oh, oh no, 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 oh no. Why? Alright, so I've been like holding this buff banner for, I don't know, two minutes here, and n nothing's happening. N no new robots are spawning. I suspect it, this might be broken or something. This, this giant heavy doesn't take damage. N nothing's happening here. It's very odd. I might as well release my buff. Wait a minute. Oh, there was a guy who was supposed to kill that guy, the, the dude to progress. We're so stupid. We're so stupid. <laughs> I don't know how, but my teammate can taunt really fast. I'm so fast. I don't know how, but you are. For no reason in particular, my entire team decided to go Demo Knight. I guess it's just one of those TF2 moments again. I don't even think this is a good idea. This is like a one dude boss battle. Alright. Oh, look. Kirby with a knife. That seems safe. And Trollface. And some teammates. It's hanging out in the spawn. This, this is a nice spawn. It has a, an Easter Island head. <laughs> some robots, cop propaganda, nuclear bomb things, and um, scout and troll face in the background. Good stuff. Whoa. Congratulations. Alright, everything seems to be in order here. This other spawn also contains a troll face dude. Okay, that's great. Let's get out of here. Whoa. Okay, a little more freaky when there's three of them staring at your back while you're doing things.
not taking any damage. I guess because he's standing in the spawn. And now we're in bumper cars. You know, at this point, I'm no longer surprised. It's clear to me that the people who created this were really talented. They came up with a unique and interesting way to do a round in MVM. Bumper cars. Who would have thought? Ah, crap, my dispenser. I'll build a new one. <gasps> That's my sentry! I don't know you! Is it weird to make a King of the Hill reference in 2022? Oh, the rock is on our team. Uh, the literal rock. Get it? You can see the rock's face in the HUD, too. Yo, check this out. The Heavy has a custom weapon that shoots rockets, and they home in on where the cursor is pointing. So, right now he's looking at the ground. That's interesting, man. Where'd he go? Wow. This wave consists of Goombas that can only be killed by jumping on them. You know, this video spoils quite a few interesting mechanics found in this tour, but it doesn't spoil everything. I promise you that. Wow, look at those rockets. Mesmerizing. Okay, I gotta focus on this boss. Whoa, the rock came out of nowhere! And he killed the boss single-handedly, pretty much. Well, we're about to lose that one. This is the quote-unquote demon crab. That was fast. Interesting observation. It seems as though they put a fence here so you couldn't push a robot to their death. Maybe it would screw up some of the logic on some of the waves. Bear with this, mortals, as I control five sentries! One, two, three, four, five! And uh, you just place a new one by doing that. Pretty straightforward. Anyways, that was the video. Thanks for watching. Au revoir!